That's so far, this is Gia of LaserBow from GamerFusion.com, and today I bring you more Iron Banner information stuff. Today we're going to be looking at the Warlock class and its armor that's going to, he's going to be able to unlock within the banner, within the Iron Banner. Now keep in mind, this is only specifically for the Warlock. I will be breaking the Titan class and the Hunter class on a separate video, so make sure you guys are on the lookout for those. And if you're a Warlock or you guys, you know, have Titans and Hunters and want to see that, don't forget, I'll also be leaving annotations for each video once they're done. So first let's start looking at the first piece of armor, which is going to be the hood, which is primarily the Iron Regular hood. And this is what our helmets primarily will look like once we are a Warlock. So if you see right there, we got the nice gold finish with the, you know, emblem of the Iron Banner as well uh, here on the top. It has a nice tree, maybe this is a tree of life or something like that. And uh, you have that on the top of the helmet. If you guys look on towards the side, we got these little, um, I don't know, uh, I would call these maybe leaves coming on from the side of the helmet. And you have that gold plated on the side as well. And then once you go to the back portion of it, you have the white right there. And on the side, you got once again replicating the uh, opposite side as well. So this is what it looks like on front face. If you bring this down, this is what it looks from the top. And if you put these, like if you kind of are looking at the person from a frontal view, you're going to be able to see that as well. You got the glass right here and you got the part in the middle so moving along with the gloves for the warlock class as you guys see right here here we have the gloves we have a nice finish as well we have the uh, white on within the knuckles primarily we have that gold finish and we also see an introduction of a new color which is kind of like a cobalt blue color with some gray offset we see the white right here and on the top we see right here it also comes with the tree so it's going to match our helmet primarily we're going to have everything coming straight from there. Kind of, so it's going to look like if our tree goes all the way to the top of our head. If you guys notice that this is the back portion of it, this is what they look like. Got that white little plate right there. I would have liked to see a little bit more white on these, to be honest. And here we go on the side, primarily what I wanted to see, which is the wolf. So it's like a wolf tree type of thing. We have him right here, which is very limitedly visible. I would have liked to see more wolf instead of more, you know, and less tree. But I guess these are the way the Warlock class is portrayed. So let me show you guys what it looks like if you guys lift up your hands like, yeah. And then if you guys bring them down, this is what they look like from the shoulders on down. So pretty good piece. You know, it looks very nice, very well made. And uh, something definitely you're going to want to equip to these. <clears throat> now remember, you're going to need to upgrade these. So make sure you pick. Next up, we have our Vestinent, which is primarily our robe. So this one is... By far one of the most sexiest robes I've seen thus far within the whole Destiny for the Warlock class. Tell me if that does not look nice. We've got the wolves in the bottom, which are primarily the, like the source of the tree. And uh, we have a nice gold, you know, uh, border around the whole robe. And right at the bottom, we have like kind of like the stem coming all the way up. And as you guys see, this looks very hot, guys. Definitely, this is going to be the first things I actually purchased. Unless I get it like a rare, you know, kind of like a uh, a raid item that I'm probably going to equip. But this does look very hot, to be honest. And uh, this is what we have right here. We got primarily the bottom is all wolfed out. And up here we got the cobalt color once again introduced, matching our arms. And on the top we have the, the, you know, the tree as well with more gold and nice trimming. So this is going to look very nice with the whole... You know, the whole armor equipped. So remember, we have like about a week to get all this stuff done. So hopefully, I'm able to get all these stuff and definitely show you guys what it looks like. So remember, once you guys have add a shader to this, you can change it any color. And it's going to keep that nice dynamic look. So it look very, very hot. So here we go. That's what it looks like, guys. And you got the gold plated on the side here, also matching the black as well. And now our last piece that we have, which are primarily our boots. As you see right there, these are primarily all black. It has a little bit of uh, the tree here as well, kind of like in our knee pads. And in the bottom, you know, you would think you would see more white and more gold, but it's kind of to offset the actual robe itself because, you know, the whole robe will prob probably cover all of this and just, you know, see our boots. So the boots have that cobalt color from uh, what we've been getting from the, you know, unit and the helmet and the arms. Not the helmet and the... Uh, the robe and the arm, so it's going to give us that cobalt color within the bottom of our boots. So it's primarily a black armor. We got a little bit of gold plated in the chin area, right above, uh, right below the knee. So these are what these look like. These are the last items we're going to probably be able to get. I'm not sure too, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not too uh, sure if I'm going to be able to equip these, but definitely the robe, 
I am definitely looking forward to purchasing getting that. So as you can know, this is primarily going to work similar to what we've seen before, where you have to level up your um, you primary level up your Iron Banner to be able to purchase these. So these are probably going to be uh, level two or level three to be able to purchase these and get enough points within the Iron Banner. So let me know if you guys plan on doing the Iron Banner. If you're a warlock, if you plan on getting any of these items, if you do, which items do you plan on getting, or you plan on getting all of these items, let me know all that in the comment section down below. If you found this video informative and helpful, make sure you guys also leave that in the comment section down below. And don't forget, guys, for all things Destiny, head over to Gamer Fusion, where we empower your gaming. Thank you